Is the ridiculous amount of stutter in Misery 2.0 weighing you down? Is it getting annoying that your computer that is certainly not a toaster is still chugging every few seconds while trying to play Misery 2? Well, there's a simple solution for that. You uh, <clears throat> browse to your Call of Pripyat folder. If you bought it on Steam, it'll be under Steam, Steam Apps Common, as shown up here. Also shown up here. Go into Game Data. Configs. Now you need to open A Life Dead LTX. I would suggest using Notepad++ to do this, though you can open it with regular Notepad. You'll just have really terrible formatting that's hard to uh, read. WordPad might work as well. But just in general, get Notepad++. It's a million times better for this sort of thing. Anyway, you want to scroll down to this uh, variable here, switch underscore distance. Now this goes on to blah -de blah blah about... Everything was uh, made for a value of 350 and hu or higher. And, you know, unless you've got like an octa-core CPU running at like something ridiculous 12 gigahertz I don't even know if that's <laughs> remotely possible um, those settings are just ridiculous and they're not going to do anything but make your game stutter I say this as somebody who's been playing this with a quad-core CPU clocked at 4.2 gigahertz with the affinity switch fix uh, to make it run on all four cores properly. What you want to do is change this line. This first variant value. This is what it will be by default. Change it back down to 150, which is what vanilla uses. And, uh... All the stutter that has been added by Misery that isn't there when you try to play vanilla should be completely removed. It uh, improves things greatly. Greatly. I don't know what the hell the programmer who wrote this comment was thinking. Or why they tuned everything to 350. But uh, it's just terrible. This makes things a whole lot better, a whole lot smoother. You don't have to worry nearly as much about running into a blind dog somewhere. Than getting killed because the game is all choppy for no good reason. I hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.